Hi everyone, my name is Donna Wellens and I'm the Education Manager of ADEA and on behalf of the team at ADEA, I'd like to welcome you to the new learning management platform. In this video, I'm just going to provide uh, a quick overview of how you access your credentialing certificate now that you have paid for your recredentialing. So congratulations, now you want to um, download and print your certificate. So it's quite an easy process. You will notice that on the um, top of the screen here, we have a menu bar that goes right across here. And you'll notice up the top here, there's a little button that says Learning Hub. So just where that arrow is. If we click on Learning Hub, this is where all of our learning activities, our catalogue, all of the educational material will sit. If we go to our learning centre, so just going to our learning centre, you'll notice that there is some buttons across the top here. We have current. So this is where all of your activities that you've enrolled in, uh, either via the catalogue um, or purchased um, through the, um, the shop as well, will once purchased and once everything's clear, all of your learning activities will sit in here, ready to be launched or started. Now, once they're completed, they will actually sit in here. And this includes your uh, CDE recredentialing programs. So this normally would sit when you're actually going through the process will normally sit within your certifications you can see this one is in progress because this is the the next recredentialing phase and as we complete learning activities through the platform it will automatically update into your learning profile but for this year's certificate now that you have completed your recredentialing you can access it in your completed section in your learning center so all of your learning activities will also be in here. So any certificate that you complete from a webinar or from a micro-credential will all sit in your completed section. So if we click on here, we can view our certificate for our credentialing, for re-credentialing. And this is my certificate here. And um, that indicates that it has the date on it of, of when your next re-credentialing is due. So I hope that's helpful. Um, there will be more videos, of course, on the entire system um, and as we step through all of the recredentialing processes as well. Okay, so thank you for listening and I hope that's helpful.